Studying abroad is a transformational experience, a chance to live and explore your identities in a completely new environment. This is true for all students, and it can be especially true for LGBTQ students. We're going to take you on a journey that will help you understand the experience of an LGBTQ student studying abroad. USAC is deeply committed to equity, diversity, and inclusion, and we're here to help you pack pride in your suitcase. There are probably as many study abroad options as there are kinds of suitcases to choose from. When picking out a suitcase, you should have certain criteria in mind. What size, color, style, purpose, cost, and durability do you want? The same goes for selecting a study abroad program. You should look at academics, costs, and the program location and length. Make sure that you research the culture of your program location and how aspects of your identities may play out differently in that new cultural context. Ask yourself, what stereotypes about my identity are there in the country that I'm going to? How much of my identity do I plan on sharing with others while abroad? Are there cultural norms and or laws that could affect my safety with regards to expressing my identity abroad? What resources are available abroad related to my identity? USAC's Equity and Inclusion webpage offers a variety of reflective questions like these, along with links to continue your research and articles from our student blog discussing the impact that students' identities had on their study abroad experience. Now that you've picked out your luggage and you know where you're going, it's time to start packing. Let's spend some time thinking about packing your suitcase with some essential pieces that make up who you are and what's important to you. What kind of clothing will you take? What does this clothing communicate about your identities? What's acceptable in your study abroad location? What about a journal? How will personal reflection be a part of your journey? What types of photos will you take with you? What communities do the people in those photos represent? How might your queer identity intersect with the other items in your suitcase? What other pieces that make up your identity will you take with you? It's important to leave some room in your suitcase for things you'll want to add on your travels. Think about that extra space you're leaving in your suitcase as some of the goals you want to accomplish when you study abroad. One important thing to remember as you prepare to go abroad is that you don't have to figure out everything on your own. You have support at USAC and your home university from folks who can help you prepare and navigate any obstacles along the way. It's time to unpack, explore, and have your adventure begin. A USAC study abroad program provides you with so many opportunities. What you learn inside the classroom will be just as important as what you learn outside of the classroom. During your time abroad, you have the potential to make new friends, complete requirements for graduation, gain professional skills for grad school or your future career, develop new ways of seeing the world, explore your host city and nearby destinations, and discover yourself. As you are experiencing your time abroad, think back to the pride-related items that you packed in your suitcase. In addition to the photos of family members, friends, partners, and pets that you brought with you, what photos have you added to this collection during your time abroad? Who's in these photos? In what ways do these photos illuminate what's important to you? If you're keeping a journal or blog, what are the topics of your entries or posts? How have you grown? What challenges have you faced? What do you still want to accomplish? Remember though, these things don't just happen automatically. The more thoughtful, present, and reflective you are, the more you'll gain from the experience. The harder you prepare and work, the more you'll grow. And sooner than you can ever imagine, your study abroad experience comes to an end. Whether abroad for a summer, semester, or year, so many students say that their time abroad went by too quickly. 
As you repack your suitcase, take an inventory of what you need to pack. What are some of the new items that you collected during your study abroad? What are some of the things that you had originally packed, but you're not bringing home with you? Which item is so valuable that you're going to pack it in your carry-on bag? Also, contemplate one of the most important questions. How have you changed during your time abroad, especially if you think about your LGBTQ plus identity? A study abroad experience is an incredible opportunity to discover so much about the world and also about yourself. Ready to start your journey?